Hello everybody, this is General Frederick back from the dead, obviously, uh, from uh, a large hiatus. Uh, and back with some more Hearts of Fire 3, their finest hour, with the modification that we all love. Random Scenario Generator. So, the, uh, yeah, it's time to play some more of this. Now, you're probably thinking, well, why aren't you continuing from the last save? Well, uh, well, it's kind of gone. I, uh, uh, it's been a really long time since I played that last save <clears throat> and well you know stuff happens and uh, the save isn't there anymore so that's a shame but uh, we're starting up a new one <clears throat> so let's go ahead and see what countries they are Romania the head of the Western civilization currently occupying like a snake right here it's a bit weird then we have the Spanish Protectorate of Morocco, edged on the side of... <laughs> wow, look at this. Spanish, yeah. Looks kind of cool. With that awful border right there. Yoink. And then we have Uzbekistan, right in the middle of India. So yeah, these are the countries. This is how the world looks right now. Um, Sweden almost got the... <clears throat> Sweden was pretty close to getting the, uh, the the original border. Let's see what... Uh, Romania, what's this? New Zealand is here. Italy. Pretty close as well. Belgium. What's this? Normandy. Oh yeah, if you're wondering why we have Normandy and, you know, a bunch of other different countries. Uh, it's because I choose uh, I chose uh, to add some new nations from uh, there's a I think it's a sub mod for um, the random HOI uh, modification. Yeah, here we are using new countries from NNM and Magrathia and added some stuff of the HPP mod. So there's some new countries in here. Oh, there's Canada. That's cool. And Flanders is occupying the entirety of Japan. Japan. And this is just a, f <laughs> just a fucking mess of countries, Jesus. This is awful. Christian, Sierra Leone, Tajikistan, Australia. Oh, wow, look at that, Australia. Let <laughs> let's hope Australia can reclaim Australia. So we shall be playing as the Spanish Protectorate of Morocco. Because why not? This looks like a fun starting position. Then when you can, then we can just expand into Russia. Um, probably pick up Republic in Spain. Jesus, look at that land size. But uh, let's see, everything will be normal, normal. Uh, yep, let's go ahead and start. And here we go the Spanish Protectorate of Morocco. Our country's name is so long that it doesn't fit <laughs> in here. That's nice. Then, then you know it's, it's a good game. Ah, no, this game is awesome. Uh, let's see, okay, 87%. Uh, in national unity, which is good. We got a good amount of officer starting ratio. And we have some diplomatic influence. We got a whoa! That's a lot of manpower. Jesus Christ. Our industrial capacity is 145. Awesome. Let's start with fixing all of this first then. And we get our strategic resource, helium. Rocket build speed. Huh. Okay, let's see here. Technology. Infantry. Oh wow, we got super awesome infantry. Jesus. And we got engineers. We got awesome cavalry and Oh, we got motorized infantry. Right from the start. And mountain and marines. Wow. That's awesome. Anything on armor? Nope. Nothing at all. But we do have awesome anti tank and anti aircraft and artillery. Which is good. Allows construction of rocket artillery. Uh, I want this one, self-propelled self artillery brigade. These guys are awesome. So let's go ahead and start Greece. Oh, put this one full. I don't think we'll be needing diplomacy, but we will be needing officers. Lots and lots of officers. Um, maybe some spies. Let's see. Zero point fifth uh, let's take 0 0.15 to begin with 
Okay, so light tank brigade because I want self-repair artillery for our units. Uh, because we have motorized infantry, which is nice. Uh, well, I can screw all this, I think. Uh, nothing research. Nothing on bombers. Nothing on fighters. Uh, let's see, census tabulation machine research is efficiency plus two percent. IC efficiency, IC plus ten percent. Leadership, manpower. Do we need rocketists? Yeah, yeah let's take it. Uh, we're gonna need nukes later on. Theory, let's see, land. Okay, so we have awesome, awesome research on large front and hmm, wow, we can even have human wave. <laughs> Guerrilla warfare. Let's take one of these and let's see your mass assault. Oh. But we need more on infantry warfare. Let's see. Let's take. Okay, let's see. Let's take um, tech movement. Uh, do we need more? Mechanized. Uh, motor. There we go. Uh, motorized. Motorized. Motorized organization. Let's take one of those. Delay doctrine. Let's see. And integrated support. Yes. And uh, let's upgrade all of these ones. And then, of course, the bombers can't forget those. Uh, let's see, production. Uh, first, we need to start building. Oh, yeah, motorized AA, artillery. Got mountains with motorized. And then we have some infantry. So, let's make a new template for let's see, motorized infantry. Boink, boink. Boink. And then we can have what speed are these guys going at? Eight. Let's see here, we don't have. Well, we have motorized AA. I don't think this. Let's build one group of these guys. Oh, we can only build three. Or maybe one more. There we go. Let's get some motorized brigades up and running. Uh, why do we have so much from reinforcements? Start with three, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. That's an entire brigade. And then let's have some infantry with artillery to slowly creep up behind the motorized and secure provinces. Oh, yeah, we forgot to check uh, what kind of land units do we have. Birka, 10 divisions, 99,994 units. Awesome. Okay, let's see here. Starting force. Air map mode, thank you. Uh, okay, so we have pretty good air coverage down here. But it's not good enough. We need closer to our borders. If we're going to be if these guys are going to be any useful at all. And I hate when it goes into red, thank you. Uh, let's see, technology. No, uh, politics. Uh, intelligence, here we go. Active domestic spies, full counter espionage, raise national unity. And then we need to go into diplomacy, automate trade, because it can't be arsed. Um, yeah, let's put all our units 10 divisions. Well, apparently, we have units. What the fuck? Well, this is a giant waste of. Well, this is a giant waste of units. Wow, fucking Christ. I'll just disband. You will never be used, like, ever. Okay, but the rest of you guys, we have nine divisions. Right, let's send them all right here. And. Then, let's see, you can stay there. What do we have for Navy? Battleships, battlecruisers, uh, standard units. Okay, uh, I think that's it. Let's go ahead and start. And increase the speed a bit. There we go. More efficient laws. I see wasted. We're wasting reinforcements. Oh, we don't need any. 
That's good. Increase that one. Decrease that one. And 0 0.10. That means we can build do, 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 an airbase. We need. Let's build two of those. And some industrial capacity. Let's build one more. Well, thank you for watching the first episode after a long hiatus. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you will also stay tuned for more. Thank you.